Hi guys, welcome back to another edition of Horse Racing Preview. <laughs> this week's feature comes to us from Belmont, so that must only mean one thing. Yep, it's time again for the Jockey Club Gold Cup. <laughs> guys, this is race 10 from Belmont, set for a mile and a quarter on the main track. It is restricted to three-year-olds and up and carries a purse of $750,000, so let's get started right away, shall we? Oh yeah, and hey guys, this is also a Breeders' Cup win and you're in qualifier for the Breeders' Cup Classic. <laughs> guys, um, I know this race is only a short, tiny, five-horse field, so it's going to be pretty darn chalky. But, and I know probably some of you might lay off this race and I'm embedded and I don't blame you if you don't. But, I thought I'd make a video anyways because you might want to you know, be like uh, my buddy Big Ron out there and bet 20, 30 bucks on this race, you know, have some fun with it. Anyways, moving right along. The winner's circle shall enclose preservationists this week. Guys, this horse is certainly the one to beat. Um, he has won the his last four of his, his won his last four of five stars. Sorry about that. Um, seriously, guys, he ran fourth, second the last time out in the Whitney. Uh, but he had a wonderful, nice bounce back to win the Woodward. You know, the race after that last time out. And definitely, this horse is gonna want to hang around the pace. You know, second and third, and then he's gonna slip past them and keep that lead and just, uh, you know, come across the wire in first for you, I guarantee. <laughs> um, guys, seriously, nothing else more I can say about this one. He's looking great to me on paper. Junior Alvarado rides again for training to Jimmy Jerkins. <laughs> guys, seriously. Um, second place, guys, I'm liking Code of Honor to run second for you. He's also coming out two big Vicks for you, you know, the Dwyer and the Travers. And, but this horse, Code of Honor, is much more of a closer for you. He's come from nine down to win the last, you know, win his race last time out. I mean, if you look further back, he's come from ten down to run second. So he definitely is capable of just, you know, hanging out in the back, moving when it's time to move, and slip and pass the pace setters out there, guys. Um, but seriously, I'm thinking that Code of Honor is going to run second. And last but not least, I'm liking Tacitus. But poor Tacitus, this horse just cannot seem to find the winner's circle. He's ran second his last three starts. Um, I mean, he's got bumped a couple times. But how many times can you blame a bump for not winning the race? You know what I mean? But seriously, guys, um, Tacitus should at least be the money for you. He could possibly win this race. Um, I'm not saying he can't. I'm not saying he's a bad horse because he really is a good horse. But, uh, sorry. But anyways, guys, I'm thinking Tacitus is just going to finish third. Uh, he can't seem to get out of the second place bonk. So, <laughs> at any rate, guys. And normally, this is a part of the uh, vlog video that I would mention in JC Upset Special. But like I said earlier, this is such a tiny little field. So it's not going to be much of a long shot to bet on in this one for you. So, fortunately, there's not, no JC Upset Special this week. <laughs> but, guys, nonetheless, if you like what you see, and I know that you do, please hit subscribe so you never, ever miss a video. And if you know someone who's going to like what they see, just pass my video their way so they can hit subscribe as well. And, guys, if you want to read all about it, JC's Horse, or excuse me, Facebook.com slash JC's Horse Racing Preview, and I'll catch you next week. Bye.